Hi guys, this camera is telling me that the battery is depleted, but it's been a couple of days and I'm sitting in the living room and we have just come back from Mia's one year appointment. I could officially give her whole milk and in addition to being able to give her whole milk, um, he said that she should only be getting about 16 ounces per day. So we're cutting back on the milk and we're giving her more food. It was very quick, <laughs> very easy. But also, you know, we're here. Fuck, I'm so tired. I can't even. I've been out this entire vacation. I've spent outside doing all sorts of things the entire time. Every so many days so far I've gone somewhere since Mia's birthday on the 15th um to the 18th to what happened on the 18th, 18th I can't remember but you know after Mia's birthday I had to recover a little bit and then I went to a festival with my friend and then I went out last night with Jules I went to her graduation yesterday for my goddaughter and then um you know just a few little things tomorrow is the last day I have to do anything but also no actually Sunday we're going to a play place with the baby so this vacation I didn't really rest but also it's vacation okay um maybe the first day I slept or not really because the first day was different just you know the vacation been all over the place but I'm sitting down on my computer right now and I'm gonna attempt to do some math homework and edit some videos so I'll see you guys later yeah. Yeah. hello everyone welcome back to my channel I'm in the kitchen today I have a quiz oh a quiz that I was supposed to do from last week which I did do from last week But it took us doing the quiz for the professor to realize he gave us the wrong quiz. So, fun times. Absolutely fun times. I don't know what's up with my light. So now we have to do the quiz all over again, which is so infuriating. But also... Um, what ended up happening with that quiz was that the questions that were on there we didn't even cover those topics yet but I attempted and I'm not gonna lie I attempted and I got I think 36% was kind of difficult so he said to disregard that one however it's still showing up on the platform like it's not disregarded put you guys here your literal only option is to try your best and hope that that's enough, you know? And that's literally what I did concerning that. Um, so we've just been chilling today. I didn't even stress myself about like going over it or whatever. I just said it though, because it's 4 11 p.m. I was gonna go over it for a little bit. The nanny comes at 9 30 tonight, and I'm gonna end up going to work with my friend. Um, I'm cooking dinner from before the class starts so that by the time the class actually starts, I already have something ready because my days like today where I have class they run up to the point where I leave to go to work so because they run up to the point where I leave to go to work I try to make sure that I have everything done me and I just woke up from a nap too isn't the most conducive not really I slept last night when I was at work I didn't even know I would have slept um, but you know things are great we're moving and we're grooving and that's just where we are right now so um yeah I'm just making this out really quickly and then I'm gonna sit down in front of my computer and I'm gonna just go over some of the things that we've already gone through and I feel like I need to just keep practicing but you know this week was my vacation and at a point this week I'm just like I really need to do things that I I want to do for myself by myself this is my first break since the year started you know it was Mia's birthday yada 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 no I wanted to just hang out with my friends a little bit not like when i have work so i did all of that and now it's like back to regular scheduled programming so here we are 
I'm making this really quickly and then I'm going to come back. My friend said she's going to start picking me up again because when she picks me up for work, she doesn't call out as much. So I have these crackers that she really likes. And I've had them up in there for a little while. So I'm going to take those for her. And um, I need to put them in my bag so I don't forget. Mommy, I'm just here walking around. I haven't done her hair in legitimately three, two days. But we're here. Honey, what is that? We're going to go get a few stuff done. So I will see you guys later. Oh, she's the cutest. Hi, all I feel like I've said this before, but I have to say it again. It doesn't always come down to what people can do for you in this life. But what it does come down to is what people choose to do for you. What's so very important is the people who decide that this is what they want to do for you. So I went to work last night. Um, that was my first night back after my vacation. And another one of the work aunties got me uh, some stuff. And she got her so much stuff. And they're so freaking stunning. So many little outfits. So, oh, this is our first time seeing them together. The dresses I absolutely love. And I think the dresses she'll be able to wear for a long time. Honey, what do you think? Put the dirty paper down. I'm sure your father rule up your life for this. So. <gasps> she got her little denim jacket. She has one like this. She bought this one in 18 months. I love it. <laughs> All of these little dresses are so stunning. I really am so grateful for my friends for how much they pour into my child. Honestly. These are so cute. These are so freaking cute. Man, we have to put one on right now. I love these. I love these. Oh, it's so cute. They're so cute. I'm gonna have to text her right now. She was like, make sure you try everything on Mia so we can know if they fit her. These are so stunning. Oh. Honey, what do you think? I have to tell Auntie thank you. These are so cute. She really didn't have to. She, when I posted Mia's birthday on Instagram, I'm like, she, Mia said to send her $5. And she was like, no. What size do you want me to buy for her? And I told her. And then she, I still didn't even expect this much stuff. And I think it really comes down to people don't have to do anything for you. But the people who chooses to, it's such a big thing. And I'm always so grateful for whatever it is that people do choose to do for me. Because, again, it's a big thing that people choose to do anything for you at all. And also, we're definitely keeping the bag. <laughs> she says, it says to Mia from March. The bag is so cute. Whoever's birthday is coming up. Look for Oh, also, she bought a little pair of glasses. And we love baby glasses in this household. This one is so cute on memes. Honey, do you want to try something on? These are so cute, babe. Oh, I love these. I really do love them. Come here, skinny butt. Let's try something on. Let's try this pink one. Give me your foot. Put your foot in. You don't know what to do. Bend your knee. Boom. Other, other one. She's sitting down. She doesn't know what to do. Hi. Hi, Nikki Nikki. <laughs> yeah. I have to send her a picture. Look, y'all. So cute. Where, where's the glasses? <laughs> Let's put your little baby glasses on. <laughs> Say hi. Hello. Hi. <laughs> so, so far, she definitely has some room in it because her hand doesn't go all the way through. Beautiful. And it's nice and long enough. That's so cute, honey. We're going to have to tell her thank you. Thank you.